Well, we've been reminding you that Tuesday is a big day for Cleveland as the clinic and Case Western Reserve University host the first presidential debate this year. Our own Leon Bibb covered the last presidential debate here in Cleveland. It was held just seven days before voters went to the polls, and it was the scene of what many believe was the knockout punch landed by the then challenger, Ronald Reagan. Cleveland is a city with big political shoulders, big enough to host a presidential candidate's debate. Hosted by Cleveland Clinic and Case Western Reserve University at the clinic's health education campus Tuesday, September 29th, two political heavyweights vying for the White House are expected to throw the verbal leather hard and fast while bobbing and weaving from the other guy's political punches. President Donald Trump and former Vice President Joe Biden are the top of the ticket. Cleveland has been the setting before of a presidential debate. In 1980, President Jimmy Carter and former California Governor Ronald Reagan went at it. Among the promoters was the League of Women Voters in Cleveland. Also in the corner were the Cleveland Press newspaper and the Greater Cleveland Growth Association, which pushed hard to land the presidential debate. I covered that presidential debate in 1980. Much of the world's focus was on Cleveland because the debate was held right here. It was Carter-Reagan, Reagan-Carter, face to face. But the world tuned in also to see Cleveland because we were in the middle of that political punch to punch. The day after, one Cleveland newspaper reported each candidate leaves the ring without errors. Some dispute that. Reagan uttered a couple of lines many thought put him over the top. Are you better off than you were four years ago? Candidates' political lives were on the line. So was Cleveland's image. Cleveland was crawling out of a bad record of its default on $14 million in loan obligations to six banks. In 1980, the city was wobbly, but the debate showed there was still fight in Cleveland. Cleveland was battling for its future as much as Carter and Reagan were battling for theirs. Getting the debate here showed that Cleveland could fight back from tough times. The 80 presidential debate in Cleveland was a turning point for Carter and Reagan, and for Cleveland, too. For 3 News, I'm Leon Bibb. We are lucky to have his perspective. And you can watch the debate between President Trump and former VP Joe Biden right here on Channel 3 on Tuesday night at 9. We will also have it streaming on WKYC.com, our Facebook page, and on YouTube.